We are standing here today to announce that a federal grand jury has brought charges against people that it alleges is res are responsible for 13 murders, 12 of them previously unsolved. Specifically, a federal grand jury has returned a 25 count indictment charging 17 people with criminal racketeering with a criminal racketeering enterprise that caused a series of violent crimes. The indictment alleges that the defendants were enforcers for the Short North Posse. These enforcers called, them their, called themselves such names as the Homicide Squad and the Cutthroat Committee. The general picture of this indictment is that there was a group of people who were involved not just in violence, not just in drug dealing, but also in witness intimidation and victim intimidation across Central Ohio. This was not just a Columbus problem. We're still looking for two individuals, Tyson Gordon, and Ishmael Bowers. So any help that the public can provide us in that would be appreciated. Uh, the number that you can call if you have any information related to that is 614-224-1183. All of the citizens of Columbus should sleep better tonight because of this. The message that we sent out to the public asking for help was fruitful and we have to continue to ask people to help us in that endeavor. Witness intimidation is a drastic problem in our community. This gang has been hit significantly. Um, you will recall that in December we announced uh, charges primarily focused on drugs, but also focused on the Short North Posse. This is the second part of that focusing on guns. This gang was also prosecuted in the mid to late 90s as well. So there have been multiple hits on this gang. We can't say that it's been decimated. We can't say that it's been dismantled. That's our goal. But I, I can tell you that they've taken a significant hit, especially on their enforcement side.